Hey guys, welcome back to Final Fantasy Brave XVS. Today, it will be a special video for you guys that watching my video. I have to say thank you to all the subscriber, all the viewer, YouTube.com. Basically, guys, I just got 8,000 subscriber. I would like to say from my heart that I'm really happy that I see this number. I never thought this could happen because first time when I come to YouTube, I thought I'm gonna get 1,000 subscribers and I will be happy. 8,000 is unbelievable, guys. So let me recap what I did last year. Okay, last year from January 1 to 2018 to December 31 last year 2018, I got total of 1.5 million views, guys. It's from all of you guys. 1.5 million. Okay, I will tell you what that means later. Watching time hours is 132k of watching time. How much is that? One, three, two, six, seven, three, divide by 24 hour. That's equivalent to 5,500 year, guys. That's you guys watching my video. No, 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 not 5,000 year. It's 5,000 day. Okay, apologize. 5,000 day, divide by 365. That equal to 15 years of watching time, guys. So thank you to you guys really, really much. Next, let's let's see what is 1.5 mean in the real world of TV series and everything, guys. So I go to Deadline.com and I check that uh, which TV you know in the last year that they have 1.5. So basically. I come really close to the, the, the Simpson guys <laughs> from Fox. Fox, you should you should hire me. Okay? So I'm really proud of myself. So let's go to the 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 main article. What is it said? I don't want to, you know, lie to you guys that this is like okay. 2017 to 18 broadcast series ranking total viewer. First one is Big Bang Theory. I love that. Why is Game of Thrones, man? I thought Game of Thrones is number one. Ah, oh, this is not legit. No, no, it's eight legit, guys. So basically, where is 1.5 million? Okay, so basically 1.5 million is like the resident that I never heard of. The 100? Sparta? Arrow? Oh, I never know about those. But anyway, guys, I'm super happy that I'm getting in line of the Simpson from the last year. It's all to you guys, guys. I would like to say thank you again. And anyway, today's video will be a special video for Pisco Damage Dealer in Final Fantasy Brave x ray guys. So, enjoy. Today will be a series of, you know, Pisco Attacker, Magic Attacker, Healer and Tanker and stuff. You guys can check in wiki for yourself for the top 10. If you don't want to check it out, I will make it for you. Alright, but this first video will be for Pisco Attacker. So, let's have a look at the top 10, guys. There are a lot of collector here that is really, really strong in Pisco Attacker. However, I will only choose 10 of them. So, number 10 is Kimono Ayaka. Kimono Ayaka come in third year anniversary, guys. Her sprite look really, really good. I love her and she is special because she can do magic chaining ability instead of Pisco, okay? That do Pisco but do magic or something like that. But she is really nice and really strong and really cute. However, today, we can give you, um, give her 18.5. Next is surprisingly to me is Alyssa Pyrrhus. Before her upgrade, she is really bad, man. But after the update, she becomes super, super strong and she still drain her HP, but she drain the enemy HP back to her. So she is decent and she come with upgrade TMR, which I think is almost equivalent to super TMR as well. So if you have her, you like her sprite, she's one of the top 10 guys. Next is Arkstar. Everyone know the Alpha Star. The Arkstar is the coolest character in the game. In Japan, in Japan, not in global. In global, he got beat up by his 
twins brother himself, Beta Star Sino. Okay, so Axta is you know is, I think she he is decent. Okay, in today's standard, and I would like to say like he can do absolute Milan triple cast through double hand, a lot of stuff that he can do, right? But but because his um yes he come with uh, C no that come with a chain of like six hundred percent when do will then he become like underdog right away. I'm I'm feel sad for you know Asta because I I love him his design everything I just like him really really much. Next is Pyro Graces Lost Well. He just got updated. I think this patch. No 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 last patch last month I mean. So he become really strong. And he can do triple cast, you know, 600% same thing. Everyone who have a 600% chain, they are really, really strong, guys. So Pyro Graces loss will get 19, okay? Next is, who is this now? Number 10, number 9, number 8, number 7 is Pyro. Number 6 is Monk Cybiet of Code, okay? So Cybiet is really, really strong, guys. I have him in my old account. With two of him, when I got a, a summon from, you know, the, the special summon anniversary or something, you can pick whatever you want, alright? And his limit burst is really, really powerful. If you can do, if you can put him under 20%, I believe, basically there's a trick on this. If you use a gravity, you know, the, the dark magic that reduces your HP by 75%, if you cast that twice on your team, with Cybia and with Edgar, he, Edgar by the way is the best breaker in my opinion. He will do plenty of damage with Edgar as well. That's the trick and he do massive, massive damage. However, not, you know, because he use Fist the most and Fist weapon is kind of weak. There's only one um, true double hand Fist in the game that come with, I think, four star collector. So if you put that into him, he will do massive damage, guys. And he's really fun to use. He can heal, he can chain, he can cleanse and stuff. You know, there's a lot of stuff in Siberia that I think is really fun to use. He's a fun collector, guys. And and for me, I like I love tank, I love monk collector in all Final Fantasy game because there are a lot of utility in them, guys. So basically. They're just fun to use in my opinion and he's not bad at all. If you have him, try him. He's really fun. However, in today's standard, there's a lot of people that do massive damage, guys. I will talk about the top three. Top three is incredible, okay? So number six is Densi Alina. Um, uh, this one is like Nina William from Tekken. Alina is nice, but all she do is shame and damage. I don't know what support she do though, so I'm not gonna make comment on those. Anyway, guys, next is I think it's top four now. So everyone knows Sino, the beta star. What can he do? He can do physical shame with fire and absolute mirror of equity fair family. And we all know that he's tanky. He have passive of ten percent of physical and HP uh, and defense. Magic and defense, I mean, that, you know, he can, you know, take the hit a lot and he's super easy to build, guys. If, I'm not sure if I make the build for him yet. I think I do. Oh, I already did. Okay, he's super strong, guys. If you build him tanky, he can do still do massive damage, guys. So basically, if you want to look into a long fight, you don't need to maximize your attack all the time, all right? Okay, so basically, I just build him like... Um, maybe 300% on attack and 200% on HP so he become like 20k HP and do a lot of damage same with Esther guys this this collector is really really strong in my opinion because you know all the new collector that come up the defense and spirit is not that high okay so with Zeno it's different story he's like become super tanky he become like superman man he do a lot of damage chain absolute miller um aurora ray chain and stuff is a lot of plenty of stuff that he can do he's still good in today's standard guys so he get 20 okay so number three now is the lightning lightning can do lightning pisco chainer can break in a pinch <laughs> i will not read this but basically 
I have to say thank you to Wiki again. If you you go to their ranking and you click on the note, they put a note in it that you know this collector is good for what and and how it's good, but it will be a short thing, guys. Like this, an absolute Milosian family. So basically, lightning is super dope. Okay, so she can do limit burst on the first turn. She can break with seventy five percent. A chainer that can break as well is is. It's a new standard, guys. So basically, Lady and Lightning, I mean, you know, she come with you know the new standard that everyone have to achieve. If you say that, hey man, I don't think Radius Lightning is number three. It's like mm, I have to disagree, guys, because she can break really, really high. Like I said, if she can do seventy five percent and do massive chain, the standard will be up there. So the person who come that want to beat lightning is have to be like 79% break and do more damage than lightning okay to be able to compete with her okay so basically she's really nice and if you love to do like what um first turn kill with limit burst she come with her own maximum limit burst from the first turn i can see a lot of possibility that can happen to lightning and another thing is he, her tmr is super duper good guys so basically lightning is top tier in my opinion and i don't have her but i want her to do form that's all because we all know that like king rain is coming up and king lane his limit burst if i remember them correctly is around 120 time multiply with chain and massive massive damage and he have a lot of utility as well so i think it's really close for us maybe three months maybe in in December we might get King Rain. I'm not sure don't quote me on that though. But King Rain and Lightning are really really similar But however King Rain just out damage everyone when he come out But I have a feeling in global right now everything just goes super duper crazy guys We got so many good stuff it Got a lot of global enchant that we don't have to pay anything Actually Gumi can decide like uh, I don't want to make you know enchant. We can just sell another collector with new skin and put those in. That's simple. They can do that, guys. But Gumi decided to be like kind for everyone, and I have to say to Gumi, thank you. But I will talk about that later. Okay. So next one is Esther. Esther is unique, and she is my favorite Pisco attacker today. Okay. I don't care who said that Sino do like trillion damage in like that calculation that it never happened in real life okay esther is special guys because we all know she have stop and charm resistant she's tanky she's super easy to use she can do boarding style absolute miller aurora ration and lightning physical damage okay and she she can tank a little bit as well she have aoe cover which no one use because she destroyed everything already okay and that's just one of the best part about her is she is the cute 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 waifu guys i think you all know this already and i think you got her i have two copy of her and i i want her super tmr very much even today right there's a lot of collector that come out like lightning and sino that's better but I still use my Esther, guys. So Esther is number two, come in 20 points as well. So 20, 20, so these three are 20. Now, for the best collector in the game is Aloha Lasvel. All right, so that, I come back to Gumi again, guys. Like I said, Gumi upgrade Aurora, uh, no, not Aurora Roswell, Aloha Lasvel, okay? He has become super super strong guys. If you see my intro, he one shot Yuga match. Okay, he one shot it. That that is not even the maximum bill. I don't even have do form on it. Okay? So basically he not even max and he one shot Yuga match, but I need three of them though. So if I, I if I only need two, I need to have do form. And my friend, thank you to um What's your name, man? Uh, Adokoda? Adoka? Or something, man. Thank you for loaning me your Aloha Lost Well. And I said, hey, hey, man, put Limit Burst on it. I'm going to Limit Burst a uh, Gilgamesh in one turn. I'm like, and then after I do calculation, no, no, no. Limit Burst is not the way to go for Lost Well, guys. You have to do like 
triple cast, um, two of the elemental chain and one cooldown ability, then Gilgamesh is just a wet paper towel. You can just sneak on it and it's just rip it off. Okay, so what's good is Aloha Lost Well. He can be AOE physical cover with evade, but you need two of him. Okay, he can reach. 80% dodge with two copy of his own TMR and you can 100% is easily if you put super TMR in that become 90 and you put like crappy stuff in it like evade or quick assault or even put um you know um you know the the Dracula lost well armor the the vampire cloak then you become 100% dodge he have provoke and he can do massive damage, which I agree with this list, okay? So, Dracula Lost Will, uh, Aloha Lost Will is super, super special, guys. So, he can do wind and water chaining plus evade. So, what I want to say, I forgot. <laughs> because I was thinking something else. But anyway, guys, Aloha Lost Will, as you can see, right? He's, he's do damage a lot. And if you see past video that I said he's the best tank, he is the best tank, guys. If you don't fight Giga Match, it's like it's like you know when you go to the boss that do magic and you use a physical cover tank, of course you're gonna die. Okay? So basically, basically bring him to the right place where you need AOE evade. Then he'll be shy in that that battle, guys. So anyway, the number one in Wiki, I will not challenge Wiki because Wiki put a lot of hard work in it, a lot of you know thought in it, and you know do all the typing and stuff. Imagine, guys, that you type all this every week. It's like work, okay? I don't know they get paid or not. They, that no advertising here. It's a good thing, Wiki. Okay, so number one is let's recap who is the best physical attacker today. Aloha lost well. Esther, number two, number three, Lightning, number four, Sino, number five, then C, Alina, number six, Monk Sebius, number seven, Pyro Gracias, Loswell, number eight, Asta, number nine, Alisophia, number ten, Kimono, Ayanka. And if you don't see anyone here, don't worry, guys. Wiki cover everything, even Randy is here. X13 is after Randy? Oh man, I'm gonna build extra. Regional suck? What? Okay, Kaito bad? Oh. NGJ? Jake is here in the top 15? Oh, wait. Oh, Reagan is here. Alright, guys, check it out for yourself. This on the list because it will take me about 24 hours to speak about all of them. And you know that I can talk for like hours non stop. But. I know you have you guys have limited time okay so thank you wiki again and of course thank you to everyone that you know watch my video and i would like to say thank you to you guys that you know support me you know, in final fantasy brave x-ray guys all right that's it for me today and i will see you guys next time bye bye guys